New at 11, homeowners in South Florida have a new option to sell their homes instantly. The popular real estate site, Zillow, is now offering to buy your house with the click of a mouse. Now, you can have a case in hand in days. This sounded too good to be true, so cbs 4s David Sutter took a closer look at this new concept called Zillow Offers. When it comes to selling on the internet, there are virtually no limits. Instead of garage sales, you can go to eBay. You can offer crafts on Etsy, and you can sell your car online. Now the same concept is coming to selling your home. I kind of think about it, if I'm gonna sell a car, do I wanna go through all the headaches and talk to strangers, uh, have to deal with all of that, or do I just wanna take my car someplace and get my check and leave? Lori Finkelstein Reader is a broker partner for the popular online real estate site, Zillow. This summer, Zillow began working with her to buy homes in South Florida through a program called Zillow Offers. Zillow Offers is an incredible opportunity for sellers who want the convenience of deciding the date they sell their home, how much time, let's say you wanna be out of your house in 10 days, two weeks, you can make that decision. The process is pretty straightforward. Go on to Zillow and click on Zillow Offers, enter in your address and details about your home, get an offer. If you accept it, Zillow does an evaluation. If everything checks out, you close. Clearly the consumer said, I wanna trade real estate the way I wanna do it, not the way necessarily we've been doing it. This concept called iBuying is actually being offered by a host of online companies. Zillow is the biggest yet to enter the field. iBuying, while convenient, does come at a cost. Real estate consultant Peter Zalewski says buyers can expect offers below what you would get on the open market. It could be 10% or more. Nobody's going to come in and pay you a competitive price and give you all the terms you want and get you out on, uh, a week from now. That just doesn't happen. Also, you have to pay Zillow a convenience fee. They say it's on average 7.5%. The fee is so that you make the decisions as to whether or not you want to, as I said, decide on your closing date, not have open houses, and just have a seamless transaction where Zillow flat out just buys your house. Once Zillow closes, they will make repairs needed and relist your home for sale, almost always for more than what you were paid. Most realtors will argue that sellers in single family homes and hot properties stand to gain more by selling traditionally. But sellers relocating in a hurry or having trouble selling, such as downtown Miami, where there's at least two years of inventory on the market, this might be a viable option to get out. I'd say go to Zillow, and if they're willing to take it, dump it, get out. Zillow is in now 16 markets across the country. They have yet, though, to close on a home here in South Florida that is underway. Before you consider doing an iBuying experience, you might want to consult a realtor to make sure it's in your best interest. In Miami, David Sutter, CBS 4 News, tonight.